our Father, your name, Jehovah, Holy Spirit, Yeshua. Thank you so much, Heavenly Father, so who you are. All the glory to you, Almighty Heavenly Father. Father, this moment, I humble myself and just before you, and I ask you with wisdom and knowledge, Heavenly Fathers, Holy, Holy, Holy Spirit, Heavenly Father, support for Heavenly Father, so like um, send out the message towards your son and daughters all over the world, Heavenly Fathers. Heavenly Fathers, please glorify you. And in the name of Yeshua, Heavenly Fathers, I ask you wisdom and knowledge, not by any of my opinions, all your heart, all your message, Heavenly Fathers. And Heavenly Father, especially purify the this Heavenly Fathers, this sanctuary, very Heavenly Father, fewers, fewers. Viewers have been placed to make this video and especially try to send out the message toward your son and daughter, Heavenly Fathers. Please, Heavenly Fathers, cover the blood of Yeshua, blood of Yeshua. Serve the holy angels surrounding me, Heavenly Fathers. Almighty Heavenly Fathers, please glorify you and give it to me the wisdom and knowledge for your kingdom and glory. And Heavenly Fathers, towards your son and daughter, Heavenly Fathers, thank you so much. I pray in the name of Yeshua. Yeshua's name, Amen. Brothers and sisters all over the world, Shalom. This moment, I truly, truly, this times want to talk about life and death. Brothers and sisters, today, in my working place, someone else come to me, and he was um, talk about. He's a begotten son. He has one son and two daughters. But the uh, first son, actually, he's really, really seriously ill and almost 24 hours need to be watched. And I was really, really, in my heart was really, really touching and it was just so sad. And how he is, and then he said he is only twenty three years old boy, and he is really really smart, and do he's doing so great in his universe university, and he is really charming, but unfortunately, he had a brain tumor, so his life is way in front of the Lord Almighty, Yeshua Christ. It was today, it was touched my heart. And I um, talked with him very gently. But the, the sad thing, because even father, even son, or even family, I do believe that they do not know Yeshua Christ, our Lord, Lord of Lord, our Pied Omega, Son of God, you know, Yeshua Christ, they do not know them at all. So, brothers and sisters, today, I would like to talk about life and death. But before I um, talk about it, actually, a lot of Christians, they are a little bit intense right now because rapture of the bride of the church is imminent. And this point of time, so we're living very significant time and towards the tribulation is happened a lot of distress and a lot of um, earthquake a lot of kind of the chaotic situation is happening all over the world the people is pretty much terrified and panic mood in this in this day so they they uh, received information and message the Lord, Yeshua Christ, is coming back very soon. The rapture is imminent. Be prepared to be raptures. But they have a gigantic panic mood. How can I? How can I prepare to be rapture? How can I prepare to be rapture? So, brothers and sisters all over the world, as your spiritual sisters in Yeshua Christ, strongly strongly recommended to you what is instructions to going back to the heaven what is instruction is going back to the heaven it is only the only one ways to go back to the heaven that is 
Yeshua Christ. He is only the key and he is only the ways to come back to heaven. So all the instructions, how can you make it happen? That is all about in the book of the Bible, Holy Bible says so. Brothers and sisters all over the world, most important thing is, this is all about the spiritual world because visually we cannot see Yeshua Christ and Holy Spirit and God Almighty and heaven because that word is invisible. That word is a different dimension of the world. In our eyes, we cannot see. That is the problem. So, brothers and sisters all over the world, truly, truly, as a spiritual sisters in Yeshua Christ, I strongly, strongly recommend it. Please, please read the Bibles from the Genesis to the Revelation. All the instructions in it to let you come back to heaven. And brothers and sisters, especially, it is a personal relationship with God Almighty, which is a first step. God knows about your heart. God knows about the, your deepest heart, what you thinking, so what you have, how much you love God Almighty or not. He knows about everything. So first step, just knee down and knee down and seek Yeshua Christ's name and just to be honest with him and just to pray and just to knee down to him and just to like pray and like that. God Almighty, I do not. I didn't know you before, but truly, truly, I want to know you. Please, I am sinner and repent. And please, please, just like, please, Yeshua Christ, come to my heart and save my soul. And please forgive my sin and come to my heart when you, your tongue is repent. And when you start to pray. In the name of Yeshua, God knows about your heart. God knows about the, your deepest heart seeking God. And that is a first step to relationship with the Almighty God, Jehovah, Holy Spirit, Yeshua. Brothers and sisters all over the world, as a spiritual sister in Yeshua Christ, I strongly, strongly recommend it just right now. If you truly, truly want to be prepared to be raptures, if you do not know Yeshua Christ truly before, just right now, just knee down and seek Yeshua Christ and come and receive the Yeshua Christ. He is the Holy, Holy Spirit. He will come to your heart and he will reveal all the what you have to do right now and he will lead you and guide you and show you and all the miracles and dreams and visions and he will show you and he will lead spiritual people and that is a start point brothers and sisters all over the world i just started this one's first and, and i want to talk about today's especially life and death especially god almighty gave to me so many vision and dreams like here and there's different angles and different heavenly different um like as a, like apostles, like long period times that is almost more than thirteen years, and started as small and big, and it is like such a drama and short, and it is a short snapshot, and it here and there are lots of vision and dreams. God Almighty showed to me. So one point of times it was really really short vision. It was like a such a snapshot, and I just draw like. I was draw like pictures actually I just like a draw like this but actually it was like a pitch black it was pitch black colors in front of my my eyes it was open and it was pitch black but you know I just write down the pitch black board. I just like write the eye in front of my eyes there was a pitch black like seems like a screen and then it was it was light it was like a uh, so many light light from bottom from bo bottoms to the from bottom to the top and there's so many lights coming down from top of the top top to bottom and so many lights you know it is from the bottoms to the going up up and down up and down up and down up and down it was 
peach peach dark like a peach dark black board it seems like it and light from the bottom and that was coming up and the light from the top of the top of that is coming down that is coming down up and down up and down up and down up and down so heavenly father show me this short snap vision this is representing about life and death so it is like right now I would like to talk about in this earth I thought about about one years ago it is like um, ours in this earth population is 7 billion people but now it's 2017 in the population of the, this earth is now is is over 7.6 almost 7.6 billion people is living in this earth so if you see very shortly birth to today's 358,000 people's birth and the death of today's 148,000 people's death today so i would like to show, i would like to talk about the very short vision about the life and death brothers and sisters all over the world even right now whatever i'm talking to you a lot of people is die and death and going back to the heaven and a lot of peoples it is born from born from the heaven so what i saw the vision even this moment the very short moments it is happening life and death is way in front of our eyes actually life and death is not far 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 away so people's thinking about the life and death is really really it is like a far 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 from you but we are 7.6 one in a 7.6 billion people living in this earth your life is individual it is very very short and you do not know when is your timing is happens to go back to heaven brothers and sisters all over the world this is bible hebrew it is a hebrew chapter it is nine verse actually 27 to 28 i will read it for you hebrew it is a new testament hebrew chapter 9 verse 27 and 28 just as man is destined to die once and after that to face judgment so christ was a sacrifice wants to take away the sins of many people and he will appear a second time not to be bear sin but to bring salvation to those who are waiting for him brothers and sisters all over the world life and death is it is very hard to talk about it but life and death our life is once and that is we are destined to die if we born some point of times one years old or 10 years old or 16 or 23 or 70 50 90 it is all about different age and different number of the age we have to go because if we born in this earth once we have to die but the brothers and sisters all over the world this is the wisdom and this is the hope because we have yeshua christ he born in this earth and he died on the cross for your sin brothers and sisters all over the world i really really want to know about all about life and death and the salvation is only belong to Yeshua Christ. Brothers and sisters all over the world, I strongly, strongly recommend it. If you truly, truly seek God, I really, really recommend it. Read the Bible so from the Genesis and the Revelation. Especially if you do not have a lot of times to read the whole Bible, I really, really recommend it. Let you read the Bible, especially New Testament book of the bible john that is a lot of information in it for you especially and brothers and sisters peace be with you no matter what no fear in you and no matter what bless you and always always peace be with you brothers and sisters all over the world yeshua christ is coming shalom be ready.